way back. It's almost like six years. Oh, six years. Yes. So you've been to that, dancing together for yeah. six years now. Have you been like performing, kind of like what you did earlier? Yes, most of the time. We also competed at the Emerald. Emerald Ball. So yes, what in kind LA. of dance and what kind of discipline uh, do you compete in? It is for standard. For standard. Uh, international so when you say standard, ballroom. what are those dances? Cheers with us. Um, slow walks, slow walks, tango, Venice um, walks, Fox. slow fox So this is international. International stuff. But earlier you were uh, dancing like American. American smooth, which American is smooth. another style of another. ballroom.
gonna we're gonna be having a couple. Her name is Helen and Resty Linga. Welcome, Helen and Resty, to a night in LA TV. Thank you Thank for you. having us here. Okay, so uh, as what I have seen in your performances earlier, it you called a tango, right? Correct. Yes. Okay, and there was a lot of liftings also and dips. So how have you been practicing in that kind of performances? Well, we started dancing in 1997. We were really, really new and we don't know anything pretty much. And we had some instructor that took care of us. And then after a few years, around late, late 20, 2020, then we actually, 1998, to 2001, then we start dancing on our own. We just keep uh, practicing, watching other people dance, the pros, and then we just kind of copy some of the moves and then incorporate it on our dance. That's why we have this kind of assorted moves that we have. It's compilation of different instructors and different techniques that we learn from other professionals. Yeah, and they've been dancing for over 20 years. And you are a couple, right? Uh, husband yes. And husband. Well, we are married. Uh, How many kids do you have? We had three wonderful sons, and they are all professionals now. Wow. And they all own their own houses. Are they also into dancing? Um, the oldest one, uh, who is in the sheriff, uh, do some entertainment, like regular parties. Uh -huh. Uh, he sings and dances uh, like the mom. Uh, I'm just here to support. That's all. Wow, that's really nice for a couple to like be doing the same hobby, you know, the same right. thing yeah. that they really love. So how about yeah. Helen? What is your most favorite dance of well, all your dances? I love to dance tango, and also I love rumba. Rumba. Yes, and that's my uh, specialty. So I keep uh, trying to learn more moves. And I'm watching Dancing with the Stars and also YouTube, you know, all these tango performances and rumba performances. So I just incorporate it in our dancing and I told my husband, we have to learn this one. We have to uh, have our moves really, you know, because that's my passion to dance.
to a night in LA. Here we are, we have another performers from earlier. We have Miss Millet Lampino and professional Mr. Tom Hicks. Welcome to a night in LA. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Okay. So what was your performance earlier? What kind of dance was that? It's waltz, American waltz. And I, I can see there was a Titanic blues ah. and music. So what was your inspiration for that? It's the movie Titanic actually. Yeah, I was actually so impressed because you even have these props like on the stage and you see the, the sapphire. Oh, look at oh, that. Hey, I'm wearing it's from it. Titanic. <laughs> wow, they really are prepared to give us their very nice performance for tonight. So how long did you guys practice for that performance? Oh, well, generally we practice uh, several weeks, maybe a couple months. We we first listen to the music, and then you're asking what's the inspiration. Generally, it's the music that inspires the choreography, and then once the choreography starts, we start getting ideas, like the idea of the boat, and then the idea of uh, going through the whole story of the Titanic, where uh, Jack and Rose have this little love story and they have the necklace that holds them together right. and then at the very end Jack floats away and she has the necklace to, as a memory and so all that goes into part into putting all the choreography together and so it takes a while each dance takes longer than some different amounts of time right. that one probably took a little bit longer because of all the thought process right. wow wow do you always have like this uh, reserved dance number like for example like uh, surprise dance number from Millet and Tom. Do you always have this reserved dance number for your, your fans? <laughs> uh, I guess they do because I've been seeing them around for so many years. I know and they're always like performing. Yeah, yeah right? Yes. Yeah. I like to create new things all the time. So we, we do uh, have fun putting things together and, uh, and enjoying our dancing. So that's the most important thing to enjoy. That's true, that's true. Putting your heart into it. Yes. How long have you guys been dancing? Oh, since 2015. Wow, 2015. Yeah, so, so they've been like dancing six for years six already. years. Six years, mm -hmm. yes. So since then, you've been like traveling, performing around the ballroom clubs? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yes. Really cool. So what can you advise those people that's been wanting to dance, but they're like, some of them are like shy, you know? They, Oh, they have to take the first step, make the phone call, go in, and, and I promise you, if they take that first step, it's, it's called dance addiction. Once you get going, you can't stop.
to a night on LA TV. We have here our persona. Miss name, her name is Luz Fernandez and Benny Co, who were our performers earlier. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Miss Be uh, Miss Luz and Benny. Thank you. So my question is, how long have you been like dancing together? Uh, at least what four months? Yeah, four, four months. Only yeah. four months? Yeah. Because yeah. you guys dance like, oh my god, like they've been dancing for like years and years. No, no. Yeah. Because they didn't see the movement. Yeah. Parang tigal-tigal nila mga partner. Well, actually, yeah. They were like, they were like, they were like, they were like, sometimes because it's uh because of uh they have a rapport and they have a chemistry, chemistry and yeah. also uh. The secret of the performers is actually from the professional. If the professional is really good, then mm -hmm. the outcome is also really good. Yeah. Ano pinapalo mo ba ng stick pag nagkakamali no, ka ng partner mo? Oh, ano mga ano strict to lang. Strict oh, lang. Talagang focus. How siya. often do you guys practice? Two to three. Weeks. Two to three times a week. A week. Yeah. Wow! So talagang kinakaririn yung pag-practice pa rin? Hindi uh, naman. Pag may mga show lang kami na. Uh, Pag ganitong pupuntahan. Yeah. Okay. So, yung preparation ninyo gano'ng katagal? I think two months. Two months? Yeah. Wow. So, pagka pag-practice kayo, two months before nila kasi sabihan na sila. Kanina tinanong ko yung um, other performer natin kung meron silang reserve performance laging nakaredy para pag pinasewa kayo, meron na kayo nakaredy. Ganun din ba kayo? Uh, kami hindi kasi nag, 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 gumagawa kami ng bago. Na always new. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. wow. Kung pwede. Parang hindi nagsasawa uh, yung mga audience nila, no? Yeah. Oo. Pero si Miss Luz, tanong ko lang, kasi nakita mo yung damit niya kanina, ang ganda-ganda. Lagi ka bang may nakaprepare na damit pagka magpupuntit? Oh, oh, naman. Oh, yeah. oh. Importante kasi sa girls yun eh, di ba? Mm. Ako din, lagi ako nagpe-prepare yung kailangan. Meron na akong nakaline up na isusunod ko for the month. Para at least hindi ka na... Ang hirap mag-isip lalo sa babae. Ay, sinabi mo. Okay. Pero kung minsan yung may motive, mas madali. Yes. Kasi, uh -huh. So, anong pinakamahirap sa'yo sa pag-practice ng or pag-create ng choreography sa isang sayaw? Kung minsan, yung pag yung paulit-ulit, mas parang nawawala ako. Pero pag yung mas madalas na, nakukuha ko naman. And what are other challenges na you encounter during uh, like musicality, body rhythm, choreography, memorizations, this and that? All of the above. <laughs> <laughs> Kung minsan, yung... You forget the next time yung ano nakakalimutan mo yung choreo ganun pero practice na sa bilila so, na Since you've been dancing for a while um do you believe that uh, dancing is also like a muscle memory? Oh yes, yes, definitely. Okay, since it's already the uh, end of the year for the year 2021 Pasalamatan naman natin yung mga taong sumuporta sa atin ng buong taon. Since, since nandito na rin tayo, pinapasalamatan natin na ating mga producer, ang, ang mga taong behind this big event. Pasalamatan din natin yung mga taong sumuporta sa atin, yung laging nagpupunta rito. Yeah, lalo yes. na yung mga naging contestant at mga winners natin sa... Mm -hmm. Stars of the, the night. night. Yes. Okay. Oo. At saka yung mga tao na palaging nandito ever since we started a night in LA on June 21st. Tandaan nang tanda ko 'yan. Monday night nag-start tayo. Ever since then nakikita natin marami talaga tayong mga mga guests na laging regular na nagpupunta rito. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyo. Without your help and support, wala po tayo ngayon dito. At saka, marami rin tayong mga followers sa Facebook natin. Yung mga right. kaibigan natin na nagsusuport, nagla-like ng mga pictures natin doon. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyo. Ano ba pangalan ng Facebook? fan page natin. A night in LA, syempre. A night in LA.